Alright, hello everyone. My name is... Let me just turn it this way. It just makes it easier. Alright, hello everyone. No, 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 no. I should turn it back this way. Alright, hello everyone. My name is Bianca Brooks. I couldn't figure out which way to turn the camera. But anyways, that's not what this story is about. As some people may or may not know, I am a coin collector. And what is the best way to find old coins is to look in people's yards. So I asked my friend if I can look in her yard, and she said, sure, whatever you find, we'll split it 50-50. Sounds like a plan. And a part of her yard, my metal detector started going off like crazy. So we started to dig, and a couple of feet below, not, not a whole lot, maybe two or three feet, we found a door. And this door was barricaded with like a whole bunch of rope. It looked like whoever closed that door did not want anyone to get in. And it had a lock on it. And she said, oh, well, maybe, you know, there's gold or something down there because your metal detector is going off. And I said, my metal detector is going off because of whatever the door is made out of, not because of what's underneath it. And, you know, I was I was telling her, I was like, I don't think we should open the door. She's like, maybe it's just like a, you know, one of those fallout shelters, the bomb shelters from the 1950s. And I was like, but your grandmother lived here with your grandfather during the 1950s. Do you recall them ever telling you that they built one? No. So I said, okay, well, let's go ask. Ask the grandma. She said no. Ask the grandpa. He said no. And they said they didn't even know that there was a door there. And I said... I really don't think that we should open the door because whoever locked it looked like they didn't want anyone to get in. And it's an old lock. It looks like a lock from the 1800s. Just because when you usually you collect coins and you go looking for it in people's yards, you usually find things like locks and, you know, you're able to tell. And that looks like a pretty old lock. It doesn't look like a lock from the 1950s. So, yeah. So, as I, hold on. Okay, sorry. Somebody in my house is asking me something. So, yeah, as I was looking at it, I just kept saying, I don't think it's a good idea. I don't think we should go looking for things there. I think we should go looking for things elsewhere. And then um, the grandfather said, well, you know, why don't you take a look at this? And it's basically like a, I guess, whoever built the house. Like, you know how the construction workers do? It's basically like, uh, I guess a drawing of the house and there's a basement but it doesn't say like there's a sub basement like nowhere in it is there a sub basement in the drawing nowhere in it is there a door that's why I don't think we should open it it's not in the drawing in all the years you guys are living here no one knew it was there so I think that we should leave it alone comment below please leave your opinions I want to know what you guys think should we open the door should we not open the door I don't think we should open the door. I don't really want to know that badly what's in it. We can look somewhere else.